at the Art Reef Rocks booth with Dwayne. Dwayne, tell me a little bit about your rocks and show them off. Okay, so I've come up with Dwayne really, really easily, effortlessly, scope your aquarium in about 10 minutes. So these ones here, all these here are modular kits, basically flat packed down into a box for easy shipping. You can see here one's pulled apart. They literally just come apart in minutes. They will all, all these flat pieces come off. Like really, really good for coral placement. You can move your corals around if you need to um, get different water flow onto them or if you need to move them up into some better lighting and that sort of thing. So these have been designed, as I said, ship all over Australia. Uh, we come into our custom work, so we do a, a loose rock uh, which is made up of a flat piece, uh, some branches and some bigger base pieces. Uh, we do pretty much a, um, a glue and epoxy kit where you can build that yourself um, or we can build it for you. So we do a, a full custom range. Um, we come over into our loose pieces, accessory rocks, we've got caves, we've got frag domes, we've got frag branches, frag flats, we've got normal flat pieces, normal branches, and then all of our glues and accessories. All right, cheers, thanks a lot. All right, I'm here at the Dymax booth with Mark. Yeah, He's good. here to tell me about the SpaceX uh, Nano LED light. Hey, going? Uh, this is the Dymax Space Light, uh, controllable, comes in marine and fresh. Um, it's got the multiple settings on it. You can actually change the colors. It's got the night light, and you can go through the settings here at 24 hour. Um, <clears throat> How much does it cost? It's um, approximately around the, about the 300, 325 mark um, retail on them. So very affordable, um, set and forget. Does it come with the mount? It comes with the mount as well, which is adjustable at the back, up and down, and then in and out as well. So. All right. And uh, what's a, the spread of, roughly? It's a 120, 120 spread on it. You get, it's about a 60 by 60 cube you can do it on it. Okay. So with the spread on the light. So, and it's got a concave um, lens on it, which helps with that spread. Very cool. Thanks a lot, Mark. All good, thank you. here at the Hamali booth with Eric, who is one of our founding vendors at Reefstock Australia. Good to see you again, mate. Can you tell me about your, your sump and your products? Yeah, mate, so family business. Um, started about five years ago. Um, five years later, this is where we're at, Hamali Australia. Been working pretty hard, trying to get where it is today. Um, now hit the international stage. We've got bulk resupplies in the US. Um, who are really you know, pushing our product over there, doing really doing really good things. Tell me about this sump. Where yeah, does so, the water come in? Okay, so this is an all-in-one uh, remote system. So basically the water comes in, in behind the roller mat. Um, it's for about a thousand litre system. Um, these are our 200 wide roller mats. Can handle up to 13,000 litres an hour. Uh, water then passes through. Um, skimmer chamber, we've got our slow flow media reactors this here. Is, this is really interesting and I haven't really seen this before. Can you tell me more about it? Yeah, sure thing. So these are individual reactors. Uh, they all run on their own pumps. Uh, so that way, you know, flow rates can be adjusted and whatnot. Um, can you show me a little bit? Yeah, sure thing. So they're built in, but they're also removable for maintenance, servicing, things like that. Everything sort of sits in there nice and nested, all your quick quick connect fittings. Um, we've got our refugium with our signature lids that we do for our AI Prime lights, Kessels. Uh, whatever lights that you have, mate, we can accommodate housings for them so the lights sit in there. Minimizes all your light spill. Um, obviously this is a custom build. Uh, most of our stuff that we do is custom. We do have our catalog line, um, which you know you can see on the BRS page. Um, yeah, got the roller mat, water passes through to the refugium. We've got an, um, a media chamber in the back, our return chamber. Got all the accessory uh, bulkheads, a big pent air UV. So the, the idea behind this was to sort of have it a compact unit. 
Very cool. Well, I love the hot rum something design. It's great to see you in Sydney for Reef Stock Australia once again. Thank and you. Uh, we'll catch you again next year. Thanks, champ. So I'm here with Lamb of uh, Fish Our Friends. This is one of our founding ven uh, vendors of Reef Stock Australia. It's great to see you again, brother. Tell me a little bit about your concept for coming to exhibit at a show like Reef Stock. My concept is just, I want that wow factor, that VIP look for reefers, that urge for them to come. So what I did is I blacked out everything there. It's like a hut that just glows with all the corals of Australia there. And what you can see is like a nightclub disco full of corals glowing, pumping, and there was like a lineup and you'll see it. That was really impressive. And uh, a lot of your corals are tank hardened, right? Yes. They're There's a lot of fresh corals here, but your tanks have been, your, your corals have been in tanks for a while. Yes, they have been tanks for a while, because my, some of my suppliers, like sustainable reefs, they've never seen the ocean and things like that. I've got them, I've got Cairns Marine, I've got Monsoon, I've got CDU corals as well for them. So as you can see with the stickers down there, that's my five main supplies in Australia. Very cool. Well, it's great to have you at the show again, man. You class up the joint and we'll see you again next year. No worries. See you again next year. Peace. I'm here with Anthony of Dalua, Australia, who's been one of the trailblazers of bringing new products to the continent and to the United States. Tell me about what's new for this year, bro. You see a lot. Wave makers, X4 lighting, Illumagic app, uh, Marco Rocks, Marco Rock Scapes, uh, yeah, quite a lot. But uh, it's discreetly new are these pumps, right? These are the new wave makers, great white wave makers, yes. You've got 6,000 all the way to 25,000 liters, super good price, and it'll all be on the Delua ecosystem in the next 12 months as well. And this is your DC return pump? That You've is had it for a while. Yes, uh, but, uh, three years now. Great White DC also will be connected to the Delua ecosystem in the next 12 months. And moving on up, e Coral been around now for four years. Still, I think some of the best software for a dosing pump. And then our biggest seller, the Great White Skimmers, all over the world now. All right, so tell me about the Delua ecosystem. It's finally here. It starts with Illumagic and it's gonna control all the Illumagic lights and then the great white skimmers, great white return pumps, great white wave makers, and it's the Delua ecosystem. Can you give us a little demo? Sure. This is the live spectrograph there and it's actually showing you the actual output of the lights, complete spectral control. That's very responsive. Yes. And it's going to, what else is it going to control besides the lights? Next is the skimmer and then the Great Right Return Pump. That will happen in the next eight to ten months. And then finally the Wave Maker. Very cool. And when do you think the uh, Illumagic app is going to come out? Because I know there's a lot of users who already have Illumagic lights. Yes. Will this work be backwards compatible with their lights? It's backwards compatible. It's getting to the app stores next week, actually, which is middle of August 2022. Very cool. Thanks a lot, Anthony. Thank you. Here at the Hanna Instruments booth of Reefstock Australia, we got Brandon here who's going to tell us a little bit about the range. Uh, so at Hanna, we have the entire range, and there's no need to do it manually. Uh, with these checkers here, we've got ammonia, nitrate, calcium. We have magnesium coming next month, and it'll make your whole process a lot easier, and you'll get some higher quality results. Very cool. What's the reception been here at Reefstock Australia to the uh, Hanna Instruments products? Oh, it's been amazing. We've had so many people come through and literally they say the only checker they don't have is the magnesium yeah. and they just love the products they even steal my job and start advertising to other people here which has been great very cool it's always nice when a hobbyist discovers that there's a digital way to do their normal tests yeah um, so yeah thanks a lot man for coming to the show supporting the show and we'll catch you next year no worries thank you George, welcome back to Reefstock Australia. It's great to see the Octo booth. Do you want to tell us a bit about what's going on with the brand? Absolutely. It's great to be back here. Reefstock, it's been a fantastic event for the weekend. Nice to see all the faces again and uh, finally be back out doing some shows again after our little uh, 
isolation periods. So um, today we're Aquariums Australia. We do a number of different brands, but we're featuring Octo. Octo is one of our exclusive ranges. Uh, Octo is literally an old horse in the aquarium game. It's They've got products that are just of the utmost quality and are refining and just improvement, improvement year after year. Octo manufacture all their own pumps. Uh, so it's a, an in-house, all-in-one stop shop that does the entire lot. Octo have an extensive range, a budget and application for every single type of aquarium that there is out there. Uh, starting from our classic range to our Regals, to our unique Essence 130, to the Elite Skimmers, and then some other little bits and pieces as well. The Argy Reactor is a nice little feature. Uh, the Argy Reactor over here has a controllable LED light and it works with a translucent body. So the idea is after you harvest some of your keto, you can turn the light down, turn the light up as the keto starts to increase in density. And when the lighting through the translucent body reduces, you know it's time to harvest your keto again. Now, a special scoop that we've got for you here today is a new unveiling of a product, which is their CO2 scrubber. Their CO2 scrubber is a media reactor, a pressurized sealed unit. Put your media inside it and polish the CO2 out of your air before it goes into your Venturi, into your skimmer. What makes this more unique than, than other scrubbers on the market is the optional cup adapter. The cup adapter enables you to now create a closed loop circuit. So if you're in an apartment, small area, you've got really pongy effluent coming out of your skimmer, we can now run that from the outlet of the skimmer back through the reactor, use CO2 media and carbon, and that'll remove the smells from the device. So this is a new little feature unveiling here, exclusive scoop, all for reef stock. Magna's coming up in a month's time. I think it's about a month. Uh, so be sure to get out there and take a look at some of the new things that are coming. We've got some really new, exciting news that's coming from Octo that uh, will be an exclusive scoop at Macna. All right. Thanks a lot, George. Take care. I'm here with Adam of Kate Aquariums. What's going on, mate? We're uh, here at Reefstock. Very excited to be here to launch four new products. Uh, they'll all be available to the international market. First one is the Ultimate S2. In Australia, the Ultimate is known as a granddaddy. It's a big, tall tank, nice and wide, uh, high bioload system. It was tradi traditionally a freshwater system, and now we've uh, optimized it to make it more suitable for salt water. Um, you know, you've got your bracing at the top, nice frame. Um, we've brought all the best features of the S2 system and the Ultimate, and we've married them together to create a perfect crossover system between salt and fresh water. I think it's probably the first in the industry to uh, be suitable for both, both fresh and salt. Um, also got the, the power management in the side there. The other door opens just like the S2 as well, so you've got all the access to the sun. This one here is uh, my pride and joy. It's a brand new nano system. Very proud of this design. It's a prototype at the moment. It'll be available in November internationally. Um, and a game changing thing that makes this different from all other nano systems is that this is not just a pedestal, it's an ATO reservoir. Uh, we've got a false floor in there, glass goes all the way to the bottom, holds 20 litres of water. I, I don't know how many gallons that is. Um, but that the tank is 60 litres, so one third of capacity of the ATO reservoir. So great to obviously there'll be no salinity swims with that. Added a beautiful protein skimmer there. That'll come standard to DC controlled. We'll dial. We'll come with a return pump as well, which is also DC controlled. It'll be uh, 1,200 litres an hour. Jump nets included. A light no, we will have a cover that runs along the front as well. Uh, the next one, people have been asking this for a while, obviously with all the accessories that are available now for aquariums, they wanted something, an accessories cabinet that can sit next to their Cade systems. So we decided to design this. We're calling it the Cade Caddy. And you'll be able to run a chiller or anything else that you want back there. Put doors on all sides. So you'll be able to access it from all angles. If you want it right up against this, you can just take these doors off, put it straight next to it. This is the Cade Reef S2 Classic 2100. It's our biggest of the S2 series. And finally, we have 
produce them in a white cabinet, something the market's been waiting for for quite some time. Overcome some challenges. We were anodizing originally. We've decided to powder coat a nice matte finish. We're doing all that in-house now, so the consistency would be perfect. And um, you know, really excited about that. It's something that uh, I think the market is going to really appreciate. We, uh, we lose a lot of sales because we we don't have a black, we've always only had a black cabinet, so uh, very excited about that. I'm here with Ravi of Oz Aquarium Distributors. This is one of the first times I've seen some of these reef factory products. Ravi, can you tell me a little bit about them? Yeah, sure, Jack. So um, we've been importing this for six months into Australia now. Um, reef factory has got a lot of different products for tank of automation and also for uh, illumination as well. Um, Cage Keeper is probably one of the most popular products in the range. Um, yeah, so the product's going really well, a uh, lot of awareness at the moment, but uh, um, there'll be more and more products coming up in future. Um, the lights are in action over there, if you can see the tanks over there, the, the blue spectrum light, and also the reflare bar. Um, fully automated, uh, controlled through an app. Every unit's got a centralized computer, so you can operate everything through um, your, your app, Refactory app. Um, there's going to be more products coming in future, including power switcher, thermal control, um, um, level keeper, the next month. And we'll, we'll have the ICP test as well within a month in Australia. Very cool. This is the first time I've seen the reef flare and the coloration of the corals under that light is really spectacular. Hey man, thanks for bringing these to the show. Never right. seen them before. Pleasure, man. Thank you. Julian, how you going, mate? Good, mate. How are you? It's great to see you again, bro. Yeah, it's been a while. How are you enjoying reef stock? I'm loving reef stock. It's, uh, it's just good to catch up with old friends. Um, the hobbyists in Australia, which, uh, yeah, it's our bread and butter, I guess. We're, uh, we're about talking to people about their aquariums, uh, learning from them, helping them to be more successful. So it's an opportunity we don't get. Yeah, and you gave a presentation earlier. Can you summarize it real quick? Yeah, so we were kind of talking about the uh, funky finds that we have um, based on our testing in our region. So we're in far north Queensland. We have an amazing uh, wealth of different habitats, fresh water, the oldest rainforest you know, on the earth, as well as the most incredible reefs. So there's a 2,000 kilometer stretch of reef, 2,000 independent reefs that make up the GBR and we've got the opportunity to look at unique habitats that we're trying to learn, do they have unique chemistry? Is it, what is the thing that causes those corals to proliferate? And you recorded that talk, where is it gonna be available? We're gonna have it on our website, on our YouTube, and I think it's across all social media channels, so you'll okay. see it there. Very cool, it's great to see you again, man, and uh, hope you enjoy the show. Thanks, mate, peeps.